I just didn't understand and just how deep rooted they are in hip hop as well. Yeah, you oh my know? gosh, man. I'm, I'm looking at this picture right here of Tupac on the on the shirt right there, and Tupac asked to marry my mom. And I first off, I gotta say, we know who Moms and Pops is. Mm -hmm. How were you so able? To create your own lane as opposed to just being the son of. You know, that's something that I tried to do from the very beginning. And it's something that my parents were aware of. And mm -hmm. they made us aware of it before, you know, we even found out from other people that there was this expectation on us. They said, hey, people out there in the outside world, they're going to, you know, say this. And they're going to say that, you know, you have to live up to our expectations of what we've done and what we've accomplished in our life. And you have to live with that. So we kind of knew that when we were young. And honestly, you know... People haven't really heard any of my music until now, but I've been working on it for eight years. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I feel like it's those eight years with all that trial and error, all those mistakes, all of those things that I had to figure out, all that growth mm -hmm. is what really got me to the point where I can start to begin to pave my own road. You know, and this is only the beginning. So I feel like it's really just that that time. And did that, you that ever, Jaden, did you feel the pressures? You know, yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. I did. Once I went out into the world and I saw what people, you know, how people feel about my parents mm -hmm. you know i didn't understand you know it's still i'm still understand more and more every day that you know they're just a staple in the world and they made people feel a type of way that no yeah. one has ever made them anyone feel so i just didn't understand and just how deep rooted they are in hip-hop as well yeah you oh know? my gosh man. I'm, I'm looking at this picture right here of tupac on the on the shirt right there and tupac asked to marry my mom yeah and she was like we're Pac, like we're best friends. Like, right. Like, <laughs> well, they say maybe your best friend, but I'm glad they didn't. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Friends, yeah. He's like, so am I. <laughs> yeah. You know? <laughs> you know, but um, so just seeing how deep-rooted everybody is in my family, in hip-hop, and in the culture, you know, that puts even more yeah. pressure on it. You know what I'm saying? But there was, like, never an expectation that you... Or, uh, like, you have to go into entertainment, though, right? No, no, no. There was never that expectation. And definitely not going into hip-hop, you know? We, right. We knew that when I was young that I would, you know, try to, you know, just mess around making movies because my dad would just film me and my sister. Oh. And, and we would make Trey Tricks. Matrix spin off. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, we would do all types getting of Getting you all ready for it, though. Yeah, getting already improvised. Did you know that things. you were doing your tuition into the school of experience? And not to quote like the original Karate Kid, but you were getting your wax on, wax yeah, off? Yeah, yeah. I didn't. I didn't know. I thought it was just that's how it was. I thought everybody's parents made movies, and I thought that everyone <laughs> made time. movies with their kids, too. You know, some of us, we don't even know our dads. You yeah, know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, totally. Take that as a blessing. Have you no. met my dad before? Um, no, I haven't. Neither have I. All right, y'all yeah, yeah. around already. <laughs> my parents always told me me that I could fly mm -hmm. my parents always told me that I could you know dig a hole to the next side of the earth you know mm -hmm. I could you know dig a hole to the center and then go off mm -hmm. pop up on the next side of the earth I would always ask them if I could do things they would always say yes wow they wouldn't necessarily be like you know go here, do it yeah you know here's the here it is here's go the, here. get that yeah, shovel yeah you know they, they wouldn't you know once it's time to go get the shovel it's like you go get the damn shovel <laughs> yeah. you know what I'm saying but they would always let me know it's like no you could you, you can do that or my dad I would say certain things like, oh, but I can't do it. And my dad would be like, what did you just say? What did mm -hmm. you just say? And then we would have an hour conversation about I got in trouble because I said that I couldn't do something. You know, and it's at like, any point where you're like, all right, okay, I can do <laughs> yeah. anything. Fine. I'm just an icon living <laughs> yeah. Fine. Or you get to the point yeah. you want to argue, like, yeah. jump off the. Yeah. I can't. No, 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 no. Okay, <laughs> fine. Literally. So that is what always made me feel. And then they would put me like they would be having a meeting about their next film or something and they would put me at the head of the table and just make me sit there while they're talking debate with all these people talk numbers talk crazy stuff and then I would just from a young age always being around that always seeing that like I am very happy that I spent my childhood with more adults than I did with kids right. my age because I was picking up more things from adults than I were from kids my own age mm -hmm. and I look and I, I go around sometimes and I hang out with other people that are my age and they're just Kind of just yeah. 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 selfie. I'm just like, dude, like, oh my god, like, can we talk about like the political and economic state of the world right now? Can mm -hmm. we talk about what's going on with the environment? Can we talk about other things? And don't worry, like, I like to turn up, I like to flex, I like to play yeah, yeah, songs yeah. loud and jump in the crowd in Atlanta. But you know, I'm always looking for that next thing. I'm not satisfied at just like a. Uh, a party. Did you ever have feelings. a feeling where you thought you or Willow y'all y'all had to be perfect? Um, no. Okay, that's 
Because I tell my kids, hey, y'all got to be perfect. Yeah, yeah. You totally. know what I'm saying? No. no, no, no. When I'm around my parents, I do feel like I have to act a certain way and right. do yeah. certain things for Could sure. Could you not curse early on? Huh? Could you not curse in the house early on? Or um, No, Willow cleared that up for us. Oh, um, okay, at an early age. Yeah, at an early age, All Willow right, decided cool. that it was okay it was to just to curse. curse as much as she it's wanted fine, to. It's okay? Yeah, but... That really didn't go over well a lot. She got in a lot of trouble, like, all the time. But she would love to, like, curse all the time. Um, I, I tried not to curse, like, in my raps. Mm-hmm. But um, I, I'm i kind of shying away from that. Like, I am I I will curse in my rap music now, but I just refuse to say uh, misogynistic um, right. uh, things. things, you know, like, a lot what of What about things. on tour? You're on stage doing your set. Do you, will you curse on stage? I, I, I curse. Yeah. But I just don't say things that degrade females. I heard that. Um, Appreciate that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, that, that's the thing. And it's hard for me to get other, like, rapper homies on my songs or do anything with them because I have to stand by those morals. Like, I released this one song with Rich the Kid one time, and it came out by accident, and... I just don't like the message of the song. Mm. You know, I don't like how it, um, um, I just don't like the lyrics. Right. I don't think it just that wasn't something uplifting. that you, and you push play on yourself. Yeah. It wasn't like, like, like this is, this is what I want to present. No, like we made that song and then it just magically came out without my permission. And then I said, ah, people are probably having the wrong visuals of this. So I want to shoot a video of us in the forest with, like, no money and no girls and nothing. It's just going to be me and you in the forest. Did y'all do it? Yeah, we did. Oh. And then, so, like, that was kind of, like, my retractment of the statement, but the lyrics still stay the same. So I just don't like that. And I want to make another song with Rich. I just don't want to have those types of words in it. And it's that. hard for me because I have to, luckily, this interview will help to explain to all of my rap homies, like, how I roll. But, like, I want to make songs with everyone. Like, I just can't have them saying all the right, shit right, that right. they say on all the other Did your family know that you were going to be in music? No. Like the way you are? No. They never thought. They would have never thought. That's crazy. So thought. did they think like, oh, he's going to be this extraordinary actor? I think like, they just like, yo, he's just going to be weird as hell and we're just so hope the world can just stand it. <laughs> you know, I, I think that's all they were saying. They're like, yo, this kid is going to be so weird. We just hope he doesn't get like stoned like every day. You right. know what I'm saying? I feel like that's more of what they were thinking. Well, well tell everyone we said hello, man. I absolutely will. You know, you won't, but... Uh, no, I will. No, because I do that too. <laughs> no, I will. No, 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 no. It's different. It's different when I have like uh, random people in the airport coming up to me like, yo, tell your dad that I said, <laughs> tell, 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 t- tell him Tony from the airport said hello I'm like wow okay yeah. but sometimes I even tell them you know dad right. just so you know um, 37 people told me to tell you to say hello dad <laughs> random in the airport but I'm gonna be like nah dad mom big boy says what's up yeah man he, he Willow put good words yeah Willow. Willow I'm gonna be like Willow yeah, yeah. Willow Willow, Willow. 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 big boy says what's up I'll probably see Willow before you see <laughs> yeah, her yeah, you know you what I'm saying nah but thank you for coming into thank the neighborhood you. man Jaden Smith in the neighborhood big boy big neighborhood boy.